the insurance industry has changed so much over the last 15 years um, with reimbursements decreasing, um, the total time available with our patients in inpatient settings decreasing as well. In the hospital setting now, more and more, we're getting less and less time with our patients, so we're really focused on trying to be as time effective and efficient as possible by enabling us to set up a patient with this, have the exercise pre-programmed, and then have them run through as kind of a home exercise program to help them achieve further functional gains during their limited time in the inpatient setting. It is very um, demanding on our bodies as therapists both to keep the patient safe and help them gain back more and more of their functional independence. Um, being able to incorporate technologies like this to have the patient still be doing beneficial uh, neuro re-education activities even when they're not one-to-one -one with a therapist will be incredibly helpful. So the more time we can spend doing functional neuro, neuro re-education and recovery exercises rather than simple setup and breakdown, it makes a big difference. If my hands are not so much focused on supporting the weight of the patient's limb or completing the motion itself, then I can really help focus on fine tuning of the movement to prevent compensations, or I can enable them to incorporate other body parts as well for a more functional task. A lot of the research in physical therapy is pointing towards that patient's active participation and the intensity of their effort with each exercise is really the key factor towards promoting recovery, enabling this machine, enabling them to initiate the movement and the machine just helps out as needed rather than doing the full movement for them will be something that's really uh, helpful for our patients.